Hi guys, I hope you are fine. And today we are going to practice Murcha Pranayama, which is a kind of respiration. I don't know if you were here last time, we did another kind of pranayama and then some stretching for our back. So let's start. <clears throat> And before I will explain how to do Murcha Pranayama and um, just sit in an easy pose or also uh, low, low pose and close your eyes, relax, put your hands on your knee, close your eyes and Start to breathe slowly to calm down your body. Then we are going to breathe for five times normally, slowly, and then when I will say it, just bend our head slightly and inhale and then exhale for three times and then I will explain other things. So five times from now just breathe normally. Now inhale and exhale deeply. Now inhaling, I will bend a little bit my head. And now I will inhale and then I will try to maintain my gaze in the middle of my hair growth with closed eye. Murcha means fainting. For this reason, during Murcha Pranayama, you can feel also some like dizziness and lightheadedness. So we start. Inhale. Full lung. Exhale. Maintain your head bent. For three times, your gaze keep him here. Relax your shoulders after three times. Inhaling deeply and exhaling, I return back with my head in a normal position and I will breathe again five times. Then I won't talk anymore, just do it two more times. Follow your breath, don't follow me. So five times here and three times here.
last time. Now slowly open your eyes and really slowly stand up and just stay in the mountain pose, breathe. your arms and stretch it gently bend to the right side feel this part stretching and slowly back again to the other side Slowly to the center. Then try gently to go backward. Don't force it. Don't worry. You can also stay like this. And back to the normal positions. Relax and fall down and continue to relax. You can move from the right to the left side. Then go up, stretch again. Go backward and back to the normal. Fall down and relax. Then from here, place your hands to your mat and back. To down facing dogs. Then here, slowly walk near your hands. And then up and stretch. Okay. Now, slowly a lateral lunge starting from the right side here place your right hand to your mat and brace the left stretch as much as possible Then 
Slowly move to the center and shift to the other side. Place your left arm to the mouth and rise the opposite one and stretch. Now slowly sit down to these legs and we are going to perform the turn positions. Breathe. Now gently rise your leg and try to grab it. Don't worry if you are not able to do it. You just stay like this or just rise your leg. If you can, you can try to hug your leg like this and try to grab the hands. This is called mermaid pose. And breathe. Then release. Move to the middle. And just breathe. And pigeon pose to the opposite side. Stay here and breathe. As we did before, rise your leg. You can stay like this or try to grab it and also to hug. the middle and breathe now gently move your abdomen to your mat Place your hand to your mat, your feet, and then plank pose. Breathe, go down, and cobra pose. Then lie down again, straight your arm forward to you rise them rise your leg and also a little bit your chest to superman pose lie down and relax Do it again. Now bend a little bit your leg. Try to grab in. You can also stay like this. And then bow pose. Release. Gently and move, move 
backward to child pose. Breathe, relax. And you stand up and then move your left leg forward and try to hug. Switch with your other leg. And then back to the child pose. Gently sit down to the middle. Easy pose or lotus pose. Place your hand to your knee. Relax completely. Open your chest. Keep your head straight with your spine. Maintain, keep down your shoulder and breathe again five times, then three times, then five and so on for three times in total. Inhale and stomach is out, exhale, stomach is in. Perform a deep respiration. Now inhale deeply. Lightly bend your head. Maintain your gaze here in the middle of your elbows with close eye. Inhale and exhaling back.
back backward with your head three times breathe here Expiring, go back. Last time. Head backward. And expiring back. Breathe three times deeply. Then slowly open your eyes. And again, really gently stand up and we will repeat the sequence as before. Rise your arms up, stretch. Inhale. And exhaling, go laterally to the right. Inhale and exhale back. Inhale and exhale to the left. Inhale and exhaling back. Maintain your arms up and then relax, fall down. Move. Up and stretch again. Now we go back. To the lateral right side and then to the opposite side. Back to the middle. Inhale and exhaling, go down. Relax. Moving to the right, to the left side. Then place your hands to your mat. And move to the back, to the down facing dog. Slowly walk to your hand 
and got up. Hop. Mountain pose. Breathe. Then again, we are going to perform a lateral lunges, starting with the right side. Place your hands, right hand to your mat and rise the other. And breathe. Gently switch to the opposite side and do the same. Then move laterally and sit down to the pigeon pose. Ice your leg and try to grab. If you want more, just fix your hands. Chin, go down and move to the middle. Don't worry if you are not able to perform a full asana, full position. It's not important. If you practice more, then you will do. Don't worry. So now move to the right side. Pigeon pose and breathe. Place your leg and grab. If you want more, try to do. The same as before. Mm -hmm. Release and go to the middle. Breathe. Now, move with your stomach. And relax. So 
slowly start to place your hands to the mat, also your feet, then push to the plank pose. Go down, lift your chest and cobra pose. Down, stretch your arm. Rise them and also your legs. And go down. And then up again. Inhale deeply. And exhaling, wrap your ankles and bow. bow. Slowly, we move backward to the child pose. Stand up. Move your leg forward. And then we do the same with the opposite leg. And then slowly back to the child pose. Gently sit down to the middle and again we are going to perform Murcha Pranayama. Five deeply respiration here.
full lung inspiration and slightly back with your head. Keep your gaze to the middle of your hair brows. Close eyes. Then inhale and exhaling, go back. When you inhale, try to count for seconds and for seconds while you exhale Inhale deeply, backward with your head, don't forget your gaze. Inhale and exhaling back. And then try again for four seconds inhalation and four seconds expiration. Inhale deeply and head back. Inhale and exhale back. Breathe for three times. Then gently open your eyes.
gently like walking with your hand moving forward and stretch your back Full relaxation. Then slowly back. And again, we are going to repeat the same sequence as before. So, slowly. Stand up. Reach your arm. Inhale and exhaling. Go to the right side. Inhale and exhaling back. Inhale and exhaling left side. And then backward. Inhale and exhaling. Relax. And move gently. Again. Stretch. Inhale and back. Down. Then place your hands to the floor and down facing dogs. Slowly move near your hands and then up. Then right side lunge, place your hand and rise the other. Slowly to the opposite side. And then moving laterally, sit down to the pigeon pose. Rise your neck, grab it, and Remember, it's not important to do a full asana, but if you can, and if you want more, try. And slowly 
release. Move to the opposite side. Pigeon and relax. Your leg, grab. Really. Pop. To the middle. <laughs> Move gently forward. your stomach to the floor and relax start slowly to place your hands and your feet to the floor and then Push to the plank pose. Then go down and cobra pose. Inhale and exhaling down. Relax a bit. Stretch your arms, raise your legs and move your arms. And down. <laughs> Again. Bend your leg and try to do the bow pose. It's okay if you just stay like this or in this position if you are not able to perform it. To the child pose. <laughs> and go back to the middle. So, perform for the last time the Murcha Pranayama. So just for one time, we breathe five times and then three times with your head bent. Full respiration in four seconds. Inhalation.
Inhale deeply. Fly over your head. Gaze to the middle. Close the eyes. Inhale and your stomach is out. And exhaling is in. Inhale and exhaling back. Gently open your eyes. And thank you. I hope you like it and I will always remember that for me and normally it's not important to perform a full position. It's not important if you have a full flexibility or mobility, just do yoga and do respiration, mindfulness, nothing more and that's it. So hope to see you next week again and bye.